They coming for you. Who? They coming for you. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. I didn't do anything. You did. I'm sorry. All I can say is poor Dale. This guy just gets roped into... As soon as he gets out of one situation, he is roped into another. So... Kareem's cousin now places the blame on this entire drug mishap on Dale. Uh, I guess what he took his photo and then sent it to like the, 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 what was it? The Mexican cartel that's behind the entire operation and essentially blames, um, Dale on the drugs being laced with fentanyl, uh, the drugs being missing, and that led to the multiple overdoses, which I've talked about in my trailer breakdown, I believe, about how it's really messed up. I mean, Hunter, as well as all the names of the people that um, Dale listed off to him, everybody got those drugs that were laced in the overdose. But which kind of confused me because if I know that Alan called to have those drugs laced, but... um. Was that every single bag or a specific order that was laced with the fentanyl? That that kind of confused me. But regardless, um, Dale is now the fall guy. The cartel is going to be looking for him. And now I feel like this is definitely going to push him in the direction that Alan wanted him to go by going to his apartment and getting some box on top of the refrigerator in the kitchen because that will protect Dale and him as well. But, um... This guy, he hasn't even been working at the pharmacy a full week, if I'm not mistaken. And look at everything that's happened. Well, he hasn't even been in D.C. that long. What? Came in on his broken down truck to leave the crazy Rakadushi city or, you know, back town that he was uh, in in Rockwell, Virginia. He tries to make an escape, hooks up with Kyle on his first night there. And then he gets roped into a situation where Donald has him shot. Then that leads into a further mishap with him and Sharon going to the White House and then Sharon, you know, gaining the attention of the president. And and the list goes on. This guy is just something else. He is dealing with a lot and he was just trying to make it through. Mm -mm -mm. But yeah, now it's like, OK, what is Dale going to do? Where is he going to go? I mean, you got to think about it. He has a huge target on his back. So anywhere he goes, that target is going to be placed on everybody near him like if he goes back to you know Richard or Nancy's house well Sharon's in jail Alan's in jail I guess he can go back to Kareem's I suppose but I don't even know if that's a smart move considering again this is Kareem's cousin that's got you know pretty much pinned him for this so I don't know I honestly don't know what Dale is going to do what he's supposed to do but Poor guy is just, he can't catch a break. So what do you think about this entire situation? Um, how is Dale going to get out of this? Can he get out of this mess? Will he try to skip town and go back home? I don't know, but let's talk about it in the comments, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.